Hi folks, nothing lasts forever and flash tube in your DSLR not the exception. It's Michael Walker's camera and I hope the problem here with flash tube because if it's electronics issues I'm not sure if I can fix it. Anyways, Nikon makes very reliable hardware so let's just replace the flash lamp. You need an old donor camera, some basic soldering skills and a tiny bit of experience with electronics. And guys, I want to warn you that the flash capacitor holds its charge for a long time and it's not like 5 or 12 volts, it's about 300 volts. So don't touch any two of three terminals at the same time. The current in the circuit is very low, so nothing bad will happen if you get zapped. Before you remove the flash tube, you have to look closely at its terminals, and you will notice that they are different. The flash lamp also has a polarity. The cathode is more emissive than the anode, and connecting the lamp incorrectly will quickly ruin it. Recognizing a broken flash tube is simple. Often it's just broken into two pieces or black sides or you can wiggle one of the terminals so there is no any more xenon gas, like in my case. Well, as you can see, it works. This flash has the same power, the same guide number. I think we saved tons of money, more than this camera costs nowadays. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. 